Hello, Geminis. Welcome to your weekly love reading. To everyone, welcome to Embracing Mattress. Thank you to anyone that has liked, shared, subscribed, has purchased a reading, donated to their page. Hit the notification bell if you haven't, please do, so that you know when I'm here. Thank you. This energy could be masculine or feminine. It could be about you, the person you're thinking of, or your crosswalk. Oh, so you want to take what resonates, leave what does not. Okay, you have the warrior. <laughs> Some of you could be dealing with a Capricorn. Just got this in the Capricorn reading. Okay. Um, whatever you are experiencing right now, all will be well. If your question is regarding love, this card represents someone who is deeply committed, protective, and kind to you. Friendship and love are sacred. And these qualities are important for a relationship to grow. If this person does not have these qualities, then move on and the universe will send you someone with a true warrior spirit instead. Remember, life is about learning and discerning who is true and who is not. Okay, now is a good time to think about how committed you are to your life's path. All right. So you guys may be thinking about someone that's not for your highest good. The divine is saying, if this person is not treating you in a way that's for your highest good, you need to leave them alone. And they will send you someone that will treat you the way that you need to be treated. Okay? Yeah, look at this. We have the engagement card. Let go of control issues. So I'm saying once you let go of the control issues that's going on right now with you uh, wanting this person... When you let go and allow the universe to do its work, to bring in whoever it is that's meant for you, your life is going to elevate to a higher commitment. Someone is going to come in that actually wants the things that you want, right? Right now, you've been trapped in your head for so long. This is the control issue that you need to, to let loose. Spirit is telling me that you, um, you're you in a mental prison because you keep thinking about the person that did you wrong. But you're going to have some good luck this summer. Okay? And this could be someone else coming into your life that's worthy of your time and energy. This could also be you letting go of the person that's on your mind right now and you falling into a different and better way of life, not obsessing anymore, not not um, not having anxiety over this person. You see in life in a new light. This person, you saw them as very self-indulgent, right? They were unavailable to you because they were with someone else. They may have disconnected from you when times were good and you didn't know what the hell just happened. They made you feel very insecure. And either some of you are feeling vengeful about it or some, someone um, or the person that you're thinking about has a vengeful person around them. Yeah. I'm hearing that some of you may not be vengeful, vengeful, but you may be saying that their karma is going to be real, you know. You may be wishing that they feel the way that they made you feel for some of you. Either way, this has been your message for the week, Gemini's. Sending love and light to all. If anyone needs a personal reading, just let me know. Information's in the box below. Thanks.